Hey guys, so today is Casual Friday and I thought I would get a little personal. Um, as many of you may know, my grandpa did pass away this week on Monday and it's been really, really tough. I was extremely close to him. He was a big part of my life, like a really big part. He actually is a big reason why I live kind of the way I do and I thought I'd kind of explain that a little bit um, and kind of dedicate this video to him because he was such an amazing man and such an amazing like grandpa father uncle like he was just he was so amazing he taught so many lessons and he was such a hard worker he taught my dad to be such a hard worker who's taught me to be such a hard worker and he was just such a huge part of our lives basically the way I grew up is I actually grew up with him and my grandma living in a huge yard and there were two houses on that yard one for my family my mom and dad and brother and sister and there was another house for my grandma and grandpa and it was such an amazing way to to grow up I got to literally almost live with them they I could hang out with them anytime they loved us they loved having us come over um, and it's interesting because they actually have four kids my dad's the youngest and every one of their kids and their grandkids had a chance to kind of live with them and, and have a chance to um, bond with them. Um, our families just always believed that families should be together and we're just really close like that. It's just kind of interesting because as you may know, I kind of took that um, philosophy and I, I'm, I'm not actually living that way too, at least for now. It may not be forever, but I can tell you what, I absolutely love it. So important for me to be close to my family and in Oliver to be close to my family. At this point, I feel like living with them is a necessity a little bit because we it is expensive in California but I also would wouldn't want it any other way and it's funny because living with your family has such a like stigma to it for some reason people feel like it's has it has this negative connotation like oh you can't go live on your own you can't afford to have your own life and your own family but for me it has nothing to do with that I don't feel like I live with my parents. We all live together. We have chosen to live together. It's an amazing life and it works for us and it doesn't work for everyone and it's not something that I think everyone should go out and do, you know? We're lucky enough that we have this great relationship with my parents and this great relationship with my family. It works out wonderfully. Mine and Brian's dream is to one day buy a house that has a house on it for my parents to live. We just, I always want to have that closeness. I don't want to go visit grandma and grandpa once a month. I want them to be a huge part of our life. Um, my grandma and grandpa taught me so much in life. I mean, I spent my day with them. I, I literally would get home from school, go over there, and we'd go right around on a golf court, and we would sing, and we would, she, my grandma was just an amazing woman, and so was my grandfather, and I just, I would love Oliver and my children to grow up that way, being really close to their grandma and grandpa, my mom and dad. It's hit me hard this week um, seeing my grandpa go, and it's been really tough, but at the same time, he is just, he taught us so much in life, and he is a huge, part and reason why you know I'm going to be raising Oliver you know my own way and it's just interesting that there is a negative connotation to it but I wouldn't want it any other way and it's an amazing life that we live some people don't even it's not even a a beautiful thought to them either it's not something that they would like strive for but that's our dream and our dream is to just stay together the most important thing to me in my life is my family everyone that I am related to and close to they are everything to me I thought I'd just kind of give you the reason why I live the way I do because I think I get a lot of questions and a lot of people are just confused why do you live with your parents we do not live with our parents we all live together and we love it. I guess this week I just decided to go a little personal for casual Friday, um, but I'd love to know your thoughts, you know? How do you feel about living with family? Would you ever do it? Would you ever agree with your with your children living with you? I'd love to know that. Like this video if you did, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Raindrops on kitchen? Wait, raindrops on? I don't know, I'm still trying, whatever. Okay, the first product I picked up this month is this super cute